Hello, 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 y'all. I've got my st my Stana shades on, honey. <clears throat> and as you can tell from this video, we have some uh, Dollar Tree items to show you. We, me, myself, and I. Always, sometimes when people say we, just say, do you have a mouse in your pocket? Um, Dollar Tree, I'll be here all week, and Walmart. And we're gonna get started right with the wall or the uh, Dollar Tree items. It's not a huge haul. First, I wanted to show you. This is just random, and I'm just looking at this in my car. Um, I keep this in my car. So when I got this, I have very okay. First of all, I'm fighting a losing battle up top. Can you see this? This receding hairline. I've just embraced it because, you know, what what else can you do about it? I'm also getting some silver in my hair, which I also don't mind. I, I truly don't mind that. The receding hairline. It is what it is. Um, I've always struggled though trying to find a hair gel. Well, I have found this super cheap. I was looking for a leave-in conditioner just because I like to use it at night when I get out of the shower, but I have found that I just use this for hair gel and then sometimes if I need a little extra hold, I'll just use spray with it. But I just use a tiny little amount of this. This is the best stuff ever. This Garnier uh, Fruit Tea Sleek and Shine, yeah, Sleek and Shine Intensely Smooth Leave-In Conditioner with uh, Argon Oil and it's from Morocco Frizzy Dry and Manageable Hair. That's me. My hair is super dry, super, super dry. And so I just use this as opposed to a gel. And sometimes the gel makes it look wet and gross, and this just doesn't. Like, I just, I really enjoy it, and I wanted you to see it. And so, I actually got it at Target a long time ago, well, a while back, and it came with a big one, and it was taped together with this little small one. And so, when I am in the car, and I need, like, a little touch-up, I just use that. So, there you go. Um, all that being said, let's do Dollar Tree first. When I get home, we will do Walmart. Um... Ever since Away Girl came into my life, Amy at Away Girl, I have been a Dollar Tree paper towel and Dollar Tree Dollar Tree toilet paper kind of guy. I don't think, Amy, that you like these paper towels. I think they're fine. They're fine for what I use them for, which is just wiping down the counters. So, you know, it's a big roll for a dollar. So every time I'm in there, I try to grab one. I got my father a bag because it's uh, Father's Day, you know. And so this is a bag for his stuff. Um, I got a cute little Hallmark expression. So I like to keep thank you cards in my car. Um, as most of you know, I do real estate on the side and I like to do thank you cards for my buyers and sellers. And um, if it's a guy, I will put a Lowe's gift card in here. If it's a girl, I will get them like a Bath and Body Works basket or um, maybe a little cute utensil holder. I can get a little bit more creative with the female gifts. I'm sorry guys out there. Typically they just like Lowe's and that's fine. But I like to include a little thank you note because they're trusting me with the sale or the purchase of their home. Um, I bought one of these the other day at TJ Maxx and I use it almost every day during the work week. I have been on this yogurt kick, thanks to Tracy B. And I get the triple uh, zero, I'll show you in the Walmart grocery haul, the kind of yogurt I get. I put yogurt, peanut butter, mix that together. Then I put frozen blueberries in there in the morning. And then at lunch, the blueberries have thawed in the fridge and it's perfect. I put grape nuts, it's a whole thing. It's a whole thing, just like Amy would say at Away Girl. But I have a mug like this that I got at TJ Maxx and it's bright and colorful, but it gets dirty all the time. And so they had the exact same ones at the Dollar Tree. It's, it's technically a soup mug that you can microwave. It has a little ventilation system in the top so it won't explode or get too hot. But I love these. I just adore them. I got my dad a cute little, uh, Valentine's, a cute little uh, Father's Day card with some kitty cats on there. It's just a cute little card. I will say this to anyone who is listening. If you get your card, I had to get a wedding card yesterday and paid more than I wanted to because I did not have time to go to the Dollar Tree. If you get your cards anywhere else from Dollar Tree, look at my Knoxville shirt. This is an ADD video, honey. It's just gonna be anything that comes to my brain is gonna come out of my mouth, so just prepare yourself mentally and emotionally for that. All right, are we settled? Okay, this is a Knoxville, Tennessee shirt. Isn't it cute? Knoxville's about an hour and a half away from me. Um, Lord, I've done lost my mind. What were we talking about? I don't even know. That's the mug. Oh, cards. <laughs> don't get your cards from anywhere else but the Dollar Tree. They're two for a dollar all the time, always. And they're Hallmark, so it's not even like they're janky, generic, weird, whatever. And bags. Bags and cards are just a Dollar Tree staple of life. They are just everything. And I have to put back as I go. I just have to. I can't I can't deal with it if it's not. Okay. 
I got two of my very favorite snaps, uh, broccoli and cheese bites. These are the frozen deliciousness. I just like to have these on standby because what can I tell you? I get hungry and I like to eat, so I like to have these. Sometimes I take my Ambien and then eat these. It's fine. Ranch dressing, it's fine. So there's that. In the next bag, um, since I don't care about quality of toilet paper, clearly, I get my dollar. That's a good thumbnail. I get my uh, toilet paper from the Dollar Tree, and we know what we do. What I do with this, it's just what you do with it. I think the last two items. This is the most fun item. It is this little Tiffany mint green blue trash can, trash receptacle. I really want to see if I can. Let's just try it. Let's just try it. I want to see if I can put it right here inside my um, seat. My little flap in the seat. Oh. Uh. Tana, hold on. Will it fit? Will it fit? Will it fit? It will fit. Will the lid go on? That's going to be the kicker. Hold on. I'm trying to put it in the little thing. It sort of works. It's a little bit big. Way. It may just have to live somewhere. Anyway, I, I always accumulate trash and wrappers and all kinds of stuff in my car, and so I wanted it for my car. It might be too big, but in the very least, I will just use it um, in my office at work. Full of paper. Last but not least, as we all know, I have two kitty cats, and they crap in a box upstairs, and it stinks. And so I am always on the lookout for things to make that room smell good. Um, I think I've tried this before. You know, they work fine. This is a SureSense Odor Absorber Citrus Scent. It's fine. It just gets stinky in there, what can I tell you? Welcome to my life of having two cats. And that's it from the Dollar Tree. Oh, and last but not least, may we never forget about the Diet Mountain Dew because it's giving me life right now. That's what's causing me to be, probably be so chaotic. There's always like particles down there in the bottom that never get fully mixed up. I'm not really sure what that is. It's probably that stuff that's going to eventually kill me. Okay. So, let me go home and then we are going to uh, show you what I got from Walmart Grocery Pickup and then we will wrap this video up. My little angels, anything you want to add, do it below in the comment section. I've been trying to do better about responding. I'm still really bad and pathetic. Um, but I do read them and I do love you. So, we'll be back. There is one little angel, and there's the other. They're looking at my bags. You wanna jump up there? There's drinks in your way. Come on, jump up. Is this your perch? Come on, come on, jump. She loves being up here, but these were in her way. Nini, they haven't seen you in a while. Go ahead, go ahead. I can usually make Gray meow only if I ask her if she wants to go O-U-T. You wanna go out? You wanna go out? She will not meow on camera. You wanna go out? You wanna go out? Tell me. You wanna go out? Gray. You wanna go out? <laughs> you wanna go out? There's another Bath and Body bag. Okay, let me move your food out of the way. Your food dish. Go on out, friends. Hurry. I take this thing and use it as a doorstop. Go on. They always act so weird, but they love it out there. Okay. Grocery haul time. Um, they always replace this. This is always a substitution for the squeeze-ups. This is the bisque. It's fine. Um... They like to lick gravy, so I give it to them. That's all you need to know about that. Um, grape nuts. I put these in my yogurt stuff like I was telling you all about in that container, actually, is what I'm going to use that for. I got a thing of just some great value peanut butter. Okay. These three items. <laughs> Here we have some Crisco. Don't even look at the stats on this. It's fine. Actually, it's not terrible. And it's, it's just soybean oil. 
So I have been watching this lady on YouTube. I, I think, I can't remember her first name, but she, her channel is called Collard Valley Cooks. I will try to remember to link it below. But she is just a good old Southern woman, honey, and she makes biscuits and gravy, and she makes all kinds of delicious stuff. I've been watching her videos, and she is a big fan of this Southern biscuit mix. You can only get this in the South, and it's a complete biscuit. So it's already got the shortening flakes in, and all you have to do is add buttermilk to this. And I have been, I'm, my mouth is salivating talking about it. So today I'm going to make biscuits and gravy, honey, and eggs in her honor, maybe some grits. So I have some all-purpose flour because I need that for the gravy. I need this for the gravy. And then I've got to have some milk, which I also have. Um, this is just some classic ranch. This is the Prairie Farms whole buttermilk. She says, do not get the low fat um, for the biscuits. These were from the Dollar Tree. You saw those. Um, I got six eggs. I can't go through eggs fast enough to get 12. So I get six. This is Quest Bar. You know I have one of these every single morning of my life. 21 grams of protein. Um, veggie bacon, which I am a huge, huge fan of. This stuff is for work. I take these to work. Quest cookies. I take these to work. Power Crunch peanut butter cream. And I also take baked Cheetos to work. Wheat Thins, the Great Value brand. And Triscuits. This, <laughs> I buy these every week now. My friend Tiana has candy in her office and I go, I eat it like crazy. So basically I'm buying it for me, but having it in her office means I eat it somewhat slower. While we're over here, I will show you my baby carrots. Um, I like to have these with ranch and my pizza. This is my all time favorite pizza. Um, I think it's a grand total of maybe $3 and it is the best pizza ever. And you people that are meat eaters, you can get it with meat. I just like the cheese because I don't eat meat. It's fabulous. Um, I like to have these for dinners on Tuesdays and Thursdays when I don't get home till super late. I like to add frozen veggies to this. Um, these are the Amy's Organic Bowls. This is the ravioli. And I thought I had another one, but I don't. Here is my yogurt for the that yogurt concoction I was telling you about earlier. I really like it. The stats are really good. Um, and they have tons of flavors. It's just delicious. Got two of the sugar-free Cool Whips. I like to have those at night with my sugar-free Jello pudding. And then we have some uh, Kitty Cravings treats. Only Nini, the white kitty, likes treats. The gray does not like any kind of cat treats whatsoever. Where is Nini? She's way back there behind the chair. Oh, Lord, there's my coffee cup and my plate from this morning. I have my coffee outside. I got to get that. Okay, y'all. That's going to do it. Thank you for watching. I'm going to put all this stuff away and start cooking. Just get to cooking, honey. So... Thanks for watching. I love you all and I mean it. Don't forget to connect with me in the social media links below. And until next time, I'll talk to you later. This is some good lighting. Goodbye.